Hello everybody, my name is Chris Beaton and welcome back to Finance of Candies 2. Now, depending on what order these videos come out in, you may already know this, but let me just start the mic because he's, th this sound is loud. Um, you may already know this, but I'm doing this back to back from when I played the other game. So, yeah. Anyway, my name is Crispy. Welcome to Fun Nights Candies 2. Welcome back to... This is night 3. We're gonna head up to night 5 in this video. Just the plan. Uh, Space. Hey, okay. three. Eric again. <laughs> you probably noticed I wasn't in class today. I got a cold. I've just been sitting in my bed the whole day. But I... During that time, I decided to Google a bit more about the factory you're staying at. Turns out I shut down back in the mid-90s due to bankruptcy. Yeah, so those robots didn't have that good of an appeal to their customers. <coughs> the robots themselves were also apparently for some old burger joint that shut down around the same time, though I couldn't find a reason why. It was probably just a lack of customers, though. <coughs> I mean, everyone around that time seems to no longer care for any restaurants that use animatronics as their main attractions. <coughs> Sorry. I also researched a bit more on that security system you're using, and it seems one of the biggest issues that have was some kind of glitch where if an electrical source got really, really, really close to one of the cameras while it was being used, it would cause a crash of the system, and you would have to boot it up all over again. But I don't think you had that issue yet, right? <coughs> Anyways, I need to make myself another tea. Good night, Marie. That's all. I was not listening to a thing he said, by the way. Oh, hey, hey, Cindy. It might only be, um, Cindy, Chester, and Penguin, mainly. Out tonight, because last night we saw Penguin, I remember, and... You know, it was like very brief, that was like one time. Okay, don't touch, don't touch camera 13 then. Hey, hey Cindy. I think it's just be a really silent night. Like I, do, I don't see myself needing to talk. Cindy. Cindy, Cindy, go, Cindy, Cindy, get out. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh, we can't use camp for 15 now. That's the one old girl was on too, yeah. Well, now she's not, so that's good. Oh, hi, Cindy, Cindy. Cindy, get in there, get in there, Cindy, get in there. Thank you. If I don't feel like checking the the front, I'm just not gonna check. Oh, I think that's life fair. She's probably gonna go down there now, right? Is 
Cindy? Cindy! You know, I've had a lot of a long time with Cindy. And I haven't taken a liking to him. What's that sound? I'm so serious, what's that sound? Oh, Cindy. Hey, Cindy. I'm 16. All right. Oh my god, that scared me. Dude, I wasn't paying attention to the time. Okay, that was about as, you know, that was calm. But I think every candy is one character is in this game, right? I don't think there's new characters in this game, right? Like, I think we've seen new candy and Cindy. New candy and Cindy? Does that mean like new candy and new Cindy or new candy and new Cindy? That's stupid. That's a dumb question. Let me shut up, bro. Obviously, there's only I think there's only been one. Where's Chester? So I'm saying, bro. Where's my goat at, for real, for real? Did they make the movement speed a little faster? Because I can't lie to you, I cannot remember what was up with these segments. These segments were cool, but I think they were a little slow. I, but I can't remember if that's true. It's again been a while. So, but um, I was gonna say, I think I said last video, which would have been the hour long video on that one game. Um, so I was planning on okay, I was planning on making a pop goes video, and I need to actually take the time to go like lay it out, script it, and actually do it. This game's loud already. Um, and I need to lay down and script it and get the visuals together and edit it. So it's gonna take a while. I was gonna, I wanted to have it prepared for when my pop goes came out, but it, I, it's not gonna come out that time at all. So, like, not even close. So it's fine though. <coughs> hey Marie, there you get it. Yeah, coffee didn't improve. <coughs> but don't worry about me. I actually wanted to tell you how good of a job you've been doing on this bed. You really are proving us wrong. I'll be honest with you. If I had lost that bed. I would have just put on a chicken costume and dealt with it. I just get way too easily by abandoned places, you know? <coughs> Anyways, I read the newspaper today. Turns out this exact factory is set for demolition really soon. Let's just hope that's not tomorrow, because then the last thing you would see is a giant wrecking ball. <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry. The newspaper also mentioned when the factory was constructed, which was around the early 60s, I think. Which is like super old, if you ask me. If you do see a robot that appears to be older than the other ones, you know, and the flashing trick would probably not work on them. The only thing you could do is lure them with those phones you got. That was the plan the entire so time. they end up in the hallway, I don't think the phone thing will actually work anymore. Because of the fact they have you in their sight now. One more thing. I asked my dad if he knew any old restaurants which had robots as performers. And he said he knew only two. One of them was about some kind of bear where he had to didn't know much about that place. But the other was a burger joint called Candy Burgers and something I forgot. Must have been a thing I saw yesterday on my Google search. Anyways, this candy guy was basically an attraction. He could sing, print food to the customers. But my dad remembers that one time the stage lights malfunctioned and were way rather than usual. And when I hit Candy in the face, he actually broke down on the stage. That means he closed the curtains and the show was canceled for that day. 
What I'm trying to say is that if you do see this candy guy, you probably need to look at the flash of the light if it gets too close to you. You never know what broken robots can do to you after all. That's all for me for now. Good job. <laughs> This guy sucks. <laughs> this must be my help, dude. No, Blake, 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 Blake. Er I'm just gonna try to keep him at the top of the building. I think he said that if he... Oh, hi, Cindy, 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 Cindy. Cindy, go. Cindy, go. Cindy, go. Oh my gosh, dude. Oh. Am I right or am I right? Like, God, I told her to go. Cindy. Cindy, go away. Oh my God. I'm confused. Am I supposed to... They can... Okay. They can literally be in the exact same area. Cindy and Blake... Blake can be in the exact same area, so I don't understand what I'm doing wrong. What do I do? What do I do? Am I... Bro. Bro. Y'all are killing me here, bro. I'm so serious. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. I'm hitting the thing. I'm hitting the thing. He won't move. He, okay, I'm hitting the thing. She won't move if he's in there. That's what I'm thinking. Like, but she's supposed to take the take the the thing, right? Is this the part where I have to start leaving the phones like all the way on? Like, I have to start like really being strategic with the phones here. So I'm assuming when he gets down to here. This is when lost. Or when he gets past that point, I should say. Okay, Blake, where are you? Come back up here. Cindy.
No. Oh. I'm cooked. Oh, I'm so cooked. Are you serious? That's so dumb. Bro. Okay, Oof. mechanics for this game are crazy. We're 21 minutes in already. That was the fourth night. I think I'm only gonna tackle up to night five. Return. Return to what? Return? Speed run. Any percent speed run. Love that. Oh my lord. Okay. We're gonna do night five and that's gonna be it for this one. Um I don't know if we'll do the other night. I'll probably do night six. Probably won't try max night or max twenty. 
Or I won't try to beat it per se. I'll just like give it a good time. Oh, sorry. I'm eating some chips here while I'm gaming. Doritos. I know I game's dated enough. Get, but not because of my cold. That already went away last morning. <laughs> and she huh. pretended I was still sick to my parents just keep Friday. Can you blame me? <laughs> Real. Anyways, um, congrats. Last night here. Really, is there anything else I can tell you to do other than you told me all So you know what? If you want to talk to me, my place. I think you deserve it. You have a crush on her, boy. You don't get too cocky. You still got one night left. But knowing you, I'm sure you got this. Good night. You know you like her. She really, really likes me. I'm for it, adore it. So come with me, enjoy it. I like it, I like, I like it. I really, really like it. I'm for it, adore it. Guys. Well, guys, 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 guys. Good job, buddy. Okay. Sneak there. Just can't stay in one place at all. Wait. I cannot Blake 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 We keep calling him Blake is because I've been watching Ruby. supposed to be in there go go get out get out you're not supposed to be in here you're not supposed to be in here you're not supposed to be in here either dude mo oh my god bro. lost it can't see her oh my god dude what was i supposed to do i literally cannot see her oh 
Link? No, really? No, that's so unfortunate. Yeah, dang, that's unfortunate. Blank, listen, we can always talk things out. We don't have to be violent. You can make a difference. You can make it right. You didn't want to make it right, clearly. Okay. Good talk. This game is a chore. <laughs> I'm like, I'm so sorry, but Jesus Christ, this game is a chore. Like, I don't mean that in a bad way. I said sorry as if I meant it in a bad way. I'm so sorry. I did not mean that in a bad way. Like, I didn't mean it in a bad way. But I, th I felt like it could be misconstrued. This game is like trying to. Oh my! This game is what I imagine babysitting is like. Not that I, I mean, actually it's not that I don't know what babysitting is like, it's just that my sister is not that bad. Like for me to, for to warrant me to like not want to watch over her. She's not loud or anything. So this is more what I expected before I was a brother. Like the paper plate guy, you know? Speaking of, um, it's unfortunate that that uh, guy left, but I mean, I'm glad he's on the bigger and better things than FNAF, right? Because I definitely wouldn't want to be, let this be the only thing I do for the rest of my life. Trust me. You have no idea. <laughs> you have no idea. So serious. I'd rather, I, it's not that FNAF is a bad thing or a bad game or community. Well, community is a stretch. Isn't that that I haven't enjoyed the memories FNAF has given me over the years? You should be right here. Yes, oh my god, thank you. It's not that I haven't enjoyed the years of the FNAF community, it's just the fact that nowadays the community is so overrun with people who take this junk way too seriously. Like, not as in, like, game development, but people who just are negative. Like, oddly negative over a game about possessed kids. Or possessed animatronics. And it's, like, really weird and kind of depressing. Like, the more you think about it, the more, like, genuinely, like, how much of a loser you have to be to actually take this junk this serious. Like, to the point where you'd harass people. Like, that sounds so crazy to me. You had to be a loser to do that. Huh. Ooh, that's not good. The laughing totally isn't uncomfortable. But yeah, I probably wouldn't want to play FNAF for like all my years, but I would definitely come back to it over time. Oh no. Wait, I'm not- wait, I'm innocent! As I was saying, I'd probably come back to this game years later. The abandoned factory on Saint Saint Antonio's Road, 27, is prescription for demolition sometime next week. This now 45-year-old factory closed in 1993 after it was deemed unsafe due to yet another fatal incident inside the factory. The factory used to belong to Robotics Robotics Corp, a company that went bankrupt shortly after the factory closed. The company was specialized in the design and production of robo robotic animatronics. It started in 1962, where they made a mechanical wire control animatronic, and over the years, the animatronics get more advanced. A total of six casualties occurred in the factory over the past 45 years. The most remembered one being in 1987, when a pair of twins went missing, and were later discovered to have been killed in one of the assembly machines in the factory. Which is the assembly machine I think we see in fin uh, Finance Candies 1, right? Whoa, Night 6. I don't know if I want to play Night 6. I'll play it, and I'll see if I beat it, but I probably won't beat it. And that, that'll... I'll see if I can come back to this uh, this whole separate entry. Hey Marie, it's Eric here, and uh, I'm a bit worried about you, honestly. I mean, you usually always pick up your phone when someone calls, and you didn't even show up to the party earlier. Are you okay? You didn't even talk to any of us after your last night. Wait. 
Are you are you at the factory again? Why? You did tell you care about this, right? Look, the bet's over. You won. What are you there again to prove something to us about how good you are? Well, mm -hmm. please don't. Look, I, I had another look at the factory before the party, and I found one of the storage rooms open. Whoa. And there actually were a bunch of animatronics inside, as I thought, but they were all torn apart, ripped to pieces, and it, it looked pretty recent. Look, Marie, I, I really didn't want to say this, but I care about you. I don't know who or what to have done this. Oh, no, 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 no. no. Danger, so please just get out of there while you can. I completely forgot about the, that guy's existence because he doesn't show up in any of the other games. It's Cat. Rat? Please, bro. Lock in. You're not answering the phone, are you? Rat. Go. Oh, you're candy. Who's Blake then? I'm assuming this guy. Do I even lure the rat? I don't think so. Oh no, 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 no. I'm so cooked. Game. I didn't even see the thing <clears throat> turn into a virus, dude. No way, I've lost. We're exactly where I left you. Okay. I'm assuming I can't look at... I'm confused. Oh, hi.
He's, he took it, okay. Okay, now I can actually see it. So I think he just does it from any camera that he's on. Right that I'm the goat. Oh my gosh, I'm literally the goat. I'm the goat. There's actually no way I first tried that. This night's what? Four no three, four, five, and six and ones. That's crazy. I did not think I was gonna do that. And you know what the funniest part is? I don't think that's every character. I think we have to do old candy as well, right? So it's like rat, cat, and old candy. Dang, boy, you sound like Pac-Man. <laughs> oh. Collect. Smooth, Blake. He's not broken, either. Uh, did we ever get to see fully fixed up Blake in the main game? Oh, I think we did, and I think it was progressively over the nights he, we didn't get to see. Or we saw him get more drawn on. Something like that, I can't remember. Blink was goaded back in the day, dude. He fell off plus ratio, am I right? Okay. 1976. This game, didn't the uh, original Knights, or the original minigame space like 1995 or 1992? Like it was between years. Oh, itching my my eye, not my ear. It's just my ear. If I run into a table, you know why. Okay. I hope I remember where these um where these things are, or even know where they are. I don't remember anything. There's an entrance in the front, right? So it's right here. Yeah. Okay, four or five, and I'm assuming it's up here somewhere. Ominous. Help. Okay, let's lock in. Chat, 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 chat. Hey, don't touch my kid. Oh, wow. Don't touch my kitten like that. That's a child. Stop that. I knew better. Come on now. Log in. August 2007. Hey, that's the year I was born. <clears throat> the old abandoned robotics factory that was scheduled for demolition has caught fire this morning. The exact cause of this fire is unknown, but experts were able to deduct that the fire originated from somewhere within the warehouse. Department of... Wait, what? Department 
the warehouse department of the factory. It was also discovered that the warehouse power schedule had not been discontinued when the factory closed, so the cost was most likely either faulty wiring or overloaded heating equipment. Local fire uh, fire brigade arrived at the factory at around 7 a.m., where uh, already most of the building was engulfed in flames. Around 8 a.m., the building finally collapsed, leaving it about behind rubble. I don't know if this implies that Mary died, but considering the fact that this FNAC horror, um, you know. Anyway, let's get into this, because I, I gotta hurry up. New Candy. New Candy Withered. New Cindy. New Cindy Withered. Blank. Chester. Penguin. The Goat. The Cat. There's one more, isn't there? Yeah, okay, let's look at these dumpsters. Love those guys. Looks good. Oh, this is the guy in the next game, right? In the game, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna replay these. Custom Knight, which... Rank- Oh, what? They have their own knight? Yo, wait, hold on, do they have it? Wait, if I do this... They have- Wait... Oh, wait, do they have their own knight separately? Oh, that's crazy. Okay, and that's FNAC 3, uh, FNAC 2, right? Um, full game. Aside from like custom night, I'm not gonna give it a right now. I gotta do some real quick. But if you like this video and you want me to do, do max 20, make sure you like, subscribe, please show, show me some love. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.